Metal organic frameworks are a class of crystalline porous materials. They are made of both inorganic and organic building components. Today, MOFs currently have applications in gas absorption and catalysis. They have been used for fuel cells to store hydrogen and methane for cars. So here are some crystals of MOF5. MOF5 was the first uh, metal organic framework that was synthesized to this lab. And it's made from mixing zinc with a terephthalic acid and a solvent such as DEMF or DEF in a vial. After we can mix everything and add the solvent, we swirl to make sure the mixture is homogeneous and then we're ready to put it in the oven. After we mix our organic and our inorganic in pieces in, the, in a vial and add solvent, we're ready to put it in the oven. We'll put it in a 60 to 120 degree oven from anywhere to several hours to several days. Behind me here is a powder x-ray diffractometer. We use this instrument to help us solve the structure of the crystals of the metal organic frameworks that we make. After determining the structure of our metal organic frameworks, we can use thermal gravimetric analysis to help us determine the thermal stability of our materials. This is important since we want to use the materials uh, to store gases and we need to later on heat them in order to release the gases without the material decomposing. The instrument behind me here is an autosorb. This instrument gives us insight into the surface area and porosity of our materials. It also gives us information about the capabilities of our materials for uh, gas absorption for carbon dioxide, methane, hydrogen, and other gases such as nitrogen and argon. My name is Kaylin. I'm a graduate student in the Aggie Lab here at UCLA.